I've got a friend's wedding coming up in a couple of weeks and I'm lucky enough to be best man. Now the focus always tends to be around women at these types of events, but it's just as important for guys to look good too. Now I'm with uh, our fashion guru, Carol Spencer, who's gonna give me a little bit of advice, aren't you, Carol? Yeah, I've brought you here to Hugh Harris, who are one of the experts in men's formal wear. But I need to look at your vital statistics first. <laughs> I'm afraid I love this bit of my job. <laughs> so we're gonna kick you out, Stephen, but first of all, I'm just gonna critique your body, if you okay, don't mind. Brilliant. Yes. So, you know, if we drop a plumb line down here from your shoulder, you'll see your shoulders are bigger than your hips. Yeah, you've got a nice flat belly there. No sign of well, a fear belly. Carol. Flat bum as well, girls, <laughs> if you're watching. Um, and also, nice profile, nice long neck that you've got there. So I've given um, another Stephen, who runs the place here at Hugh Harris, all that info. And Stephen is going to now bring your suit based on that info. This will be the best outfit you've ever worn. Oh, look forward to it. <laughs> Wow, that looks great, Stephen. You like it? I'd have to say pink's not really my colour, Carol. <laughs> but I'm sure the bride's got something to do with that. Yeah, so. women rule on colour. <laughs> they rule on colour for weddings. You've got to match the bridesmaids. Yeah, but it really is a great fit. You know, because you've got the long neck, then you suit the wing collar and the slim tie. And this light, shiny fabric, you wouldn't want to do that, you know, if you've got a bit of a beer belly. And the fit of the, the jacket, this real sharp cut, is great for your triangle shape. But you're not really a typical British male, are you, Stephen? <laughs> no, no. You're too male model. We need a bit of extra padding, I think. You need a bit of a beer belly. <laughs> <laughs> Stephen, that is an awful lot of beer you've drunk over 10 years. <laughs> Not bad. So you see, we've got all these problems now. You've got a chubbier face. So what we need is not a wing collar, but a low spread collar with a nice big chunky cravat that's going to balance the rounder face. And definitely not a light, shiny waistcoat like this. You want a darker colour or one that's going to blend with your jacket so the eye isn't drawn here. And because we've now got the shirt showing and the pants sagging under the belly, we need braces to hoist all this up. Mm. <laughs> Off you go, we're going to get you something better. <laughs> Much better, Stephen. You're now wearing your belly well, <laughs> aren't you? You see, what we've done is we've moved all the focus of attention from that bright, shiny, flowery waistcoat up here, all the colours at the top. Um, and with this lower wing and the much bigger knotted cravat that balances your bigger face and also giving you a bigger flower so it keeps everything in scale with your body. It looks fab. So yeah. you think I'm all set for the uh, the wedding? I love the style, not yeah. sure about the body shape. But no, uh, and the blue really suits your eyes, yeah. All right, so you're going to be my date. Yeah, okay. 